I still need to clear Fort Ironwood, like I said. Like I keep saying. Diligent, th thorough thief until the end. I thought maybe he was making a full loop around the memorial, but no. We'll just wait until we can get in behind both him and Gamal. It sh shouldn't actually take too long, because Gamal, at least, is moving pretty regularly. Here, that's good. I will climb up to the furnace from here to get the fire arrow. I do wonder what's going on inside Fort Ironwood and in the catacombs, if it's all the same, if there are more, if there are less. Guess I'll find out, won't I? Nice. Damn. Looks like I will still have to go all the way down and mantle up onto a coffin to climb back up. Which I suppose is fine. It does seem like the guy who's normally in that hallway is gone, so... I'm gonna go now. No Hammerite, but there is a statue here. I haven't seen or heard him move, though. Let's see if I can get by him. Good. Good so far. Looks like he's just chilling. Let's get the two holy waters, as always. I should be able to, let me see what's going on down there. Seems like the main hall is actually empty. Let's find out if that's true. Yeah, I see no one here. Gamal must have wiped him out. No goodies here either. Even our usual two coins are gone. Well, let's visit the catacombs one last time. Friend Zombie is still here. That's good. Nice to know some things haven't changed. This is, of course, the last time we'll be in the catacombs. Last time in the game we'll see zombies. So... And hammer haunts, both, so enjoy it. What a long, strange trip it's been. It's over now. Okay, I've got this set up this time. Let's get the water arrow out of the grate.
Oh, <sighs> look at that. Must be that must be one of Gamal's statues. Oh, there's a, there is a statue down here. Things have changed. This area is empty. The usual haunt is not here. Excuse me. I wonder, can statues kill zombies? I don't know. I don't, don't want to find out either. Let's get out the door while they're fighting. Got the usual silver candlestick, worth 50. And I think that's probably everything. Yeah, I think that fight's gonna go on forever, because the zombies can't hurt the statue, and I don't think the statue can hurt the zombies either. Well, let's... We may have inadvertently said goodbye to our last hammer haunt already. Oh, there he is. Later, bro. We hardly knew ye. Goodbye catacombs, goodbye zombies, they're all over. Well, once we get past this last zombie anyway. There we go. No more zombies, hope you enjoyed it. No more Fort Ironwood catacombs, and very soon no more Fort Ironwood. Now, given the way the hammers were behaving, I think I'm going to need to take the exit out of the graveyard. So. Shouldn't be too hard to get by Gamal and their statue again. Let's get down here first. It's only a green alert, but I still don't think I need to take it, so I don't want to. I thought they couldn't hear me running on grass. Maybe the statues have more acute hearing than your standard AIs. Seems that Gamal, meanwhile, just has delayed reactions. I'll have to wait out another cycle. But he takes a long, slow walk off to my right, so that shouldn't be too hard. So I'm going to use the memorial as hardcover to get to here, which is a fine position. From here, I can get right past her, no problems. Alright, see you later Fort Ironwood. Where does it think I should go next? The docks. So I will. I'm gonna head to the docks. We're not quite done with Old Quarter because we have to do South Quarter last, so... I'm gonna hit the docks, and then the... come back through Old Quarter to get to Stone Market. 
So let's get to the docks gate. Which is this way. If I need to, I'll be able to take the rooftops. They managed to kill the only statue out here. Good for them, I guess. What? I bees find you, city. Now what? Die. <laughs> well, the pagans in Aldale did not care about me, but apparently this one does. Duly noted. Over there is. Aha, Good there you grief. Be Wasn't he going the other way last time? I guess it doesn't really matter, but. Let's just. Just sit here and wait. Okay, yes, he is going away. But to where? That's the big question. And there's another one. Which sea? Which sea? Money is nothing to me. One. We bees getting stronger. <sighs> it bees not long before we can walk freely and green as the city for ourselves. All right. To the docks. Same deal as usual out here. I'll grab that fire arrow to start. The failsafe. The last of all glyphs. Have things become so bad then so soon? Tempting is the power of the glyphs and weak are little humans like you. Alright. City Watch Crime Report, District of the Docks. The following criminal incidents occurred last evening in the vicinity of the docks. Zero citizens were murdered. Zero citizens were rendered unconscious by a blow to the head. Five items of valuable property were reported stolen. One locks were unlawfully picked open. The above is a true and complete record of events. All residents are encouraged to report suspected incidents of crime to the nearest City Watch authority, signed the Office of the Commissioner. Sweet. Right. I'm gonna get those coins first. One of Gamal's statues is over there. Last time we're gonna rob this poor fisherman who once saw the Cetus Amicus. His coins are there as usual, worth 25. If you'll just give me a second, my mouse cord got caught on something. There we go. We're much more familiar with the docks. We've been coming here since day four. Oh my. All right. Looks like the pagans won the fight. No telling how many of them are left, but Fire arrow here at Dahlia's. Let's sell artwork well, and gems. What's the delay, you got. I hate that f waiting for that fade in, but let's grab the get. She didn't see anything, which is good. Over 
It's like the statue bagged two of them, but the third managed to destroy him. So I'm gonna sneak, just because. She going. I don't know. I gotta get across the bridge and get that moss arrow. Same as always. This is our our last trip through this little bit of pagan territory. I almost get a little nostalgic knowing that it's finally the end. She saw the corpse. For a minute I thought she saw me, which was confusing since I thought I was very well hidden. Alright, the usual guy on the ground level isn't here. Those coppers are always there. Still are. Very nice. Let's get up the stairs now. I can't even, I have no idea what's procedurally generated and what's static at this point, because in addition to the statues, it throws in so many extra shamans and priests, so I'm just not bothering with pickpockets. <laughs> so we need the two noisemakers from the table. And the copper's out of the chest. And we have cleared the pagan territory for the final time. That's it for all faction territory. We have no need to cross into any of it again. Something happened to Garrett just then, and he got stuck. I was reveling in the sense of triumph that comes with... ...not having to rob the factions anymore, but... ...the game had one last little hiccup for me. Got stuck. Can't have that. Alright, well they will doubtless blame me for this murder, so let's stay out of sight. Get up the stairs. And let's get out of here. Sounds like this statue is still alive and well. Why wouldn't he be? I think he mirrors what was the Watchman's patrol, so... Oh, this poor fellow's dead. <gasps> I'm warning you! I'm calling for help right now! Oh boy. Not only that, but at some point that fellow had seen a corpse and is now hostile to me. It couldn't have been that hard to program it, so... People only went hostile if I actually murdered someone, could it? Doesn't seem like it should be that hard, anyway. Just wait right here to get by the statue. Be angry at this civilian. He hates me for no reason. Any guards around? Now the statue will kill him for me. Oh, maybe not. I was about to say, here comes some sweet satisfaction in the form of seeing 
an annoying jackass get murdered, but no, the statue didn't mess with him. How odd. Find the watchman. Fine, you head back that way, that's fine. Alright, I'm gonna go down to the sewer to get the water arrow. Oh, it's the last time I do all of it. Last time in the dock sewer. Last chance to wave at the Kershock. Bye bye forever. I have little doubt that this poor guard is not long for the world. Fighting back. That's really. There he goes. That's more like it. Now let's move out behind the statue. Climb the wall and get the gas arrow. here. Have to be careful, obviously. We've added statues, but I want the fire arrow out of that torch, like always. Now let's head, creep over toward first landing. No one has seen fit to mess with that watchman. Good for him. Gamal's over here, so I imagine nothing else is. Need to get the water arrow out of the pipe. While she's out there, I'll creep out to the first landing marker and set the paw. So far, so good. Now there's only two artifacts left to place. So that completed, place the paw on the first landing marker in the docks. Of course, I need to keep an eye on Gamal, because I still need to get the broadheads off that crate and go clear the tavern. If you want to kill Gamal, this is the place to do it. I cannot find I am busy. Yes, very busy. Cannot be bothered with this. You. Oh, she saw me. Something is here, taunts me. Oops. On, so far, so good. Now there's only two artifacts left to place. This should be a safe spot, I think. Let's watch her, see what she does. It is gone. It flees me. Very clever, very smart. My creepy crawlies, my chicks, my stone walkers, my eyes, my ears, my spies. Come to me and tell me what you see, you spy, you hear, you tell me. Oh, my puppets, my pawns, my tools. Oh, so stupid and so willing. And Orland, fool, best of them, the worst of them. 
Read my words, Orland. Draw my glyphs, Orland. Do my work, Orland. And never, never, never know! <laughs> There we go. That's all I needed. Let's get the two broadheads. Let's go in through the main door while her back is turned. Sounds good to me. Now that we're in here, it's business as usual. Fire arrow in the fireplace, two bits of loot upstairs. Copper fork. And jade ring. We'll probably come back one more time to the docks just to uh, fence all my artwork, but that's about it. So, let's read this note. Brother Vault, it has come to our attention that the pagans are after a small tree that recently arrived by boat to thy district docks. Tis imperative they don't obtain it. If tis anything like the pagan magics thus far, it will be bad for us indeed. The cursed thing is being held by the city watch. Methinks they must side with the pagans, or perhaps greed has to overcome their sense of righteousness. If thou thinkest an offer of more money would set things aright, then twould be a goodly plan. Brother Ondelot thinkest we should burn the tree in a furnace, that the furnace, most blessed vessel of the will of the master builder, will destroy the tree and consume its terrible magics. Tis a furnace in the tavern there in the docks, and perhaps by the builder's grace twill do the job, though tis a poor substitute for a hammerite furnace, Brother Constance. I never knew about that, till just now. Anyway, like I said, the docks are clear. It's probably not quite time to say goodbye yet, because I'll be back to fence the last bit of artwork after I clear the other two districts. There's the Overlook Manor. You can see it really clearly with the Abysmal Gale gone. I'm just taking my time, taking in the sights, since the game's about to end. Anyway, for now, I want to creep all the way back to Old Quarter. I'll just wait until Gamal's back is turned. The moment when she's leaving this area should be perfect. Is it him? Did I see? Did I spy? Still nothing. He oh. is not here. It was the rat. Huh? She alert- green alerted to the rat twice. I'm not gonna worry about that. Oh. Statue found my watchman. So well, let's... Give him a nice wide berth. And head back to Old Quarter. Cause remember we have to do South Quarter last. Something about that just didn't feel right. I'm gonna watch that from the end of the street instead. And see if the statue still alerts or not. Silence. 
There's nothing but quiet, nothing but silence. Alright, you go right ahead with your green alert. I do not care. course the fight starts the same just the same yeah it didn't alert because that's only a good hiding spot for unalerted patrollers not people in combat I think it heads up toward Old Quarter from here. So... I think I'll wait right here until it turns around and gets past me again. Well, we're headed to Stone Market next, and that's very familiar territory. We've been going there since day one. So I just need to get to the entrance to Stone Market proper. Where is everybody? I was gonna say there were buco pagans here last time. And by buco, you know, I mean two. Gotta start walking eventually. There he goes. I see a veritable gaggle of city watchmen down there. Dare approach me unannounced. Well, I, guess I shall find thee if thou makest but one more noise. He solved my pagan problem for me, around. at least. He just panicked because of the bodies. Be found out here long. Sorry to get you all riled up. Ooh, there's a dead body back there. Come and see. All right, all right, just show me. It was right here. Don't look at me like that. I'll check around if you're sure this is the right spot. That people Could have been a ghost. Over. Oh, that'd be something. What's all this? Yeah, that I really tears up. 
This is our last trip through Old Quarter. I just have to get to the Stone Market entrance. <clears throat> but... It's proving a little bit difficult. Hopefully, Stone Market won't be the pain in the butt it's been the last couple days. If I had to guess, I'd say it probably will be, just because I don't seem to be that lucky. Jumping at nothing. Getting all worked on. Alright, let's let him get back to his patrol route, which I think is over by the Keeper compound. And let's move into Stone Market right behind him. Alright, now we are done with Old Quarter. Fare thee well. All y'all, bye bye Of course, I get the feeling that Stone Market is going to be the catastrophic pain in the ass it's always been. Share flesh and blood, thief. It is through your eye that I see. Painful, was it not? To lose it. But that's why you are the one. Only you are attuned to me. And only I can initiate the failsafe. Alright, well. This might be a good opportunity to run over here at least. Seems like everyone's probably dead. Except for that guy. But Gamal will kill him soon enough. Before she comes back, let's get the gas arrow and set the crown. Crown goes right here. Four of the five are all set. I can't stop now. Let's get the gas arrow up here. While the area is nice and clear. I can't forget I need to go to Cawthorn's Armory. Where I will find, as always, two broadhead arrows and silver coins inside the safe. sound like no mouse lapping up spilt ale. Gamal will waste all of them in good time. Is lurking by the oh, what is it? So we've completed the objective, place the crown in the storage area at the base of the clock tower in Stone Market proper. They're just guys spawning in over here. Maul will make her way over here eventually, but I just want to head into the Stonecutter's house. Watch this! Go to where you heard it. Total chaos out there. I mean, absolutely crazy. Ruby, pile of silver coins, and a copper ring upstairs. I mean, Gamal's invulnerable, but she still can't seem to keep up with the pace at which the game is respawning everything she kills.
and kill and find and kill. Didn't want that. I wanted a silent drop if I could manage it. This is definitely the exit we want. I can tell you that much. We do not want to open the ground level door into this street. That'd be suicide. See me? <laughs> Must have. I need to manage a quiet descent over past the statue. Like I need to get over to the awning. <laughs> 